Games behind the line. Three, two, one, dive. As the autonomous period starts, five of the six robots move off the starting line. That will be worth three points each for those teams. The Red Alliance is also able to place one coral on its reef. Everybody moving off, and a coral place that should be worth a ranking point. Tally up, period starts. Team 64. 11, the Grave Diggers, appears to be not functional right now, so this will be a three on two match. Red Alliance almost puts some algae into the net. Over on the Blue Alliance side, Team 1891, the Bullbots is battling with the Punchers to try to have access to its coral loading area. On the Red Alliance side, the Cobra Commanders are unimpeded with grabbing more coral and putting them on the reef, as is their teammate, 3245, the Ravens. The punchers from the Red Alliance are down on the Blue Alliance area. Playing defense to try to keep the Blue Alliance from getting more coral to put on their reef. Blue Alliance is diligently filling up the top level of its reef with the coral. Coral that is located on the second or third level of the reef but it has algae touching it will not be counted towards the total. Thirty-two, forty-five. The Ravens is eyeing up, putting some more coral on its reef. He thinks better of it. The metal bots have been working to clear algae off their reef, so that they the submarine sound is a signal to the teams that they can now return to their barge area and begin the ascent back to their barge. It appears that the Cobra Commanders have succeeded the Alliance victory. Final score of 99 to 51. The Red Alliance managed to not only get the victory for three ranking points, but achieve the other qualifications. They